The Piedmont Reliability Project has stirred controversy for many Maryland residents. It proposes upgrading state's electrical grid, but would require more than 70 miles of overhead power lines in Baltimore, Carroll, Frederick counties all together. And people in all three counties have spoken out against the plan at several public meetings, and there's another one tonight. Miana Massey in your corner with the details. Good morning, Miana. Well, good morning, Cena and Tim. For months now, we've been following the growing concerns over the Maryland Piedmont Reliability Project. And so neighbors are really worried about their homes and their livelihoods if this project moves forward. As you said, tonight, neighbors have yet another chance to voice their opinions here at Horford High School. And so the project is a proposed environmentally focused upgrade to the state's electrical grid. The goal is to put in 70 miles of 500,000 watt transmission lines to alleviate growing strain and ease congestion on the grid. Maps show the lines connecting to an existing BGE transmission line in northern Baltimore County, then going through Carroll County and into southern Frederick County. But the plan is sparking controversy as it passes through vital land. And so homeowners, farmers and small business owners have expressed their concerns. They're worried that the project could destroy their properties and hurt the environment. It's going to be within about 120 feet of my father's house. It's going to be tearing down woods, the forest that I live in. It's an atrocity. And so the company over this project says that they will take in a community input into account when finalizing these plans. Again, you have yet another chance to voice your concerns or opinions. That's tonight at Horford, Hereford High School, rather, at 630. For now, Miana Massey reporting live for WJZ.